Do I have to file ISF for bow ties? Welcome back to our channel, where we provide valuable information and insights into the world of customs brokerage, customs bond, and international trade. In today's video, we will be addressing a common question that many importers have. Do I have to file an ISF for bow ties? Let's dive in and find out. Before we answer the question, let's quickly go over what an ISF, or importer security filing, is. An ISF is a requirement by U.S. Customs and Border Protection, CBP, for all shipments being imported into the United States. It is an electronic filing that collects important information related to the goods being imported, including details about the importer, consignee, and the shipment itself. Now, when it comes to bow ties, the requirement to file an ISF depends on various factors. Firstly, it's essential to determine the value of the shipment. If the value exceeds $2,500, then an ISF filing is mandatory. However, if the value of the bow ties is below $2,500, you may be exempt from filing an ISF. While the general rule is that a shipment valued over $2,500 requires an ISF, there are a few exceptions to keep in mind. If the shipment is being imported by a government entity, is a personal shipment, or falls under certain exemptions such as goods transported by vessel under non-commercial conditions, an ISF may not be required. Even if your shipment of bow ties falls below the $2,500 threshold, filing an ISF can still be beneficial. By voluntarily filing an ISF, you demonstrate compliance and enhance your relationship with CBP. Additionally, it provides you with accurate information about your shipment, ensuring smooth customs clearance and avoiding potential penalties or delays. Navigating the intricacies of customs requirements, including ISF filings, can be overwhelming. That's where a reputable customs broker comes in. They are experts in customs regulations and can assist you with filing the necessary paperwork, including the ISF, ensuring compliance and a hassle-free importing experience. Whether or not you need to file an ISF for your shipment of bow ties depends on the value of the goods. If the value exceeds $2,500, it is a requirement. However, there are exceptions to consider, such as personal shipments or non-commercial conditions. Remember, even if you fall below the threshold, Voluntarily filing an ISF can still benefit you in terms of compliance and smoother customs clearance. Thank you for watching today's video. We hope this information has been helpful in answering whether you need to file an ISF for bow ties. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell, so you never miss an update. Stay tuned for more informative content on customs brokerage and international trade. Disclaimer note below. See you in the next video.